Yeah. Where's that Junior? Junior. Bonnie? Junior for we with you. different coming to the Derby this time than when you all came with Bodie Express. This horse got the business of winning a race done first time out. Correct. Um, yeah. yeah. And more Express from Florida it was amazing. Yeah. Yeah. But they both were second in the Florida Derby to Correct. earn the trip here. So talk about Mage and how is he different from Bodie's Express bringing him here? Uh, uh, both horses talented. Big difference in behavior though. This is a more quiet, more focused, and mature horse. Uh, Bodhi, it, it, it took a while for him just to get things straight, but he was talented as well. And it didn't happen at the Kentucky Derby, but Bodhi also gave you a very memorable performance at Churchill Downs when he came back and won the grade one. The Clark. Clark. Yeah, definitely. Uh, it basically proved that uh, whatever we were doing, bringing him to the derby and trying the prickness, that we were right. I mean, it just took a, uh, um, maybe more time than expected, but, but he was, he, I mean, he had the talent and he was a really good horse. He's only run three times, one first time out, was fourth, I believe, to the champion in the Fountain of Youth. Correct. And then came back and was a really good second to the champion Forte in the Florida Derby. Talk about his development um, from the first time you ran him. Yeah, uh, he's just like you said, lightly race. Um, just three starts, one better than, than 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 the previous one. He's been progressing, improving each race, and I think. And another thing is that he he did in three different styles. First race he ran in front. The second one he run like pretty much like in the middle of the pack, and the last race he came from behind. So uh, he's still figuring him out. We still figure him out, and but he's a really talented horse, and he just he gives us a feeling he's just he's gonna get better the races. Uh, if you if you're looking for uh, in this race like um, for a price. I think this is the right horse because because it's a uh, is um, put up 14 a corner I would say last time out so if you like Forte you, you gotta like this horse and I have the feeling that he likes this track so it's it's a matter of keep improving if he keep if he keeps improving race after race like he he's he's been doing it he's gonna be tough. Maybe if, if we had a couple more races, it would be a different situation. We were talking about maybe a, a top three favorite. I, I, I do, honestly, I think so. Uh, he, might, and he might end up be there like later on during the season. If he stay off of it, sound. Now you have named Javier Castellano uh, to ride. Yeah. And this sort of talk about having him as your Well, Javier rode him second time. Uh, and he knows the horse really well. Um, we've been lucky with him before. Uh, the right thing to, I think, go we have here for this race. He, he pretty much wants to win the, this race. I don't think there is anybody, any rider that wants to win him more, more than him. Uh, we understand he's probably on the race, he has big race he hasn't won, so. He's gonna get a good chance for him. For when you first came 2016 here, horses that didn't race it two, that only raced three times, it was hard to see them um, going on and winning the Derby. However, since then, these horses are also lightly raced. It doesn't seem like it's the issue that it. Of course, Justify, who was a Triple Crown winner, didn't race it too, but. But still, it doesn't seem like it's the issue that it used to be if you didn't run it two or you only have three races. I think that's going to change with time. 
because it's different now. I mean, for for everybody, and I think it depends a lot on the horse too. Some of them are way more mature than others, and especially this time, and they change so much between races, and some handle different tracks better, some handle the crowd different, and it's a 20 horse field. I think mm, there's no one single horse that can be ready for that, so we will see how, 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 how they behave and how they perform. Yeah, like everybody says, after last year, anything can happen. A horse anything that literally happen. got in last second. Exactly. Wins. Yeah, and with Boat Express, he was in the race, he, I mean, he was in contention and, and he got bumped and the other thing happened. So, you never know. It's a, it's a tough race. It's, it's, it's hard on them, but it's the one that we all want to win, that's for sure.